Hello, welcome to Hidden Collections. Today we'll be doing the first of two boxes of the True Steel. We're doing the Zamazenta box today. And then on Thursday we'll be doing the Zashian one. So if you see the thumbnails, they're going to look the same. But check out the pins and the figure in it. They're going to be a little different. Uh, we're going to be doing that. So it comes with, so I flip it around and everything. Uh, two Darkness Ablaze, Sword and Shield, Team Up. Burning Shadows, Evolutions, but wait, and then we have some loose boosters to go with it as well. I was going to use these packs for some other uh, videos, but I was just like, eh, let's just uh, change it up, or, I was like, I was like, someone did a video on it last week, as I closed my eyes when I'm trying to think about that, um, someone did a video last week and I'm like, there's new boxes out, how do I not know about these new boxes? So, I was like, uh, they're not in the video themselves, so, I'm like, switch, <laughs> put those up there, so, we got the new, uh, boxes, my, uh, booster boxes of Darkness Ablaze, um, hopefully we'll be here, Parasect, Marash win. um, we'll be here, hopefully sometime this week, I'm hoping to do a video on I will be doing a video on Saturday of a booster box, so uh, that will be, oh, look at that, Cosmic Eclipse, white code card, does that mean anything anymore? Hopefully. So, not the energy, Absol, Flareon, Roller Skater, Jilber, Tangela, Eevee, Duskull, Tample, Natu, and... The babies, Togepi, Cleffa, and Igglybuff. This is the first time I've actually pulled this card. <laughs> um, if you know, if you've seen old video, I don't remember what videos they're in, but I'll understand that I've pulled, I think, more white code cards that have nothing um, behind them than anything else. So I'll put that right there. Take a quick pause. Uh, I'm sure, you're, of course, you've seen other people talk about these. But uh, I'm going to also be opening this in the opening. I just saw it right next to me. I'm like, don't forget about this. This is probably one of the best deals. You can get one Darkness of Blaze and one Sword and Shield. I've seen others open these where they have a Darkness of Blaze and a Rebel Clash. But this is $4. So for $4, you get two packs. I, had to, I scanned it at the machine, and then I had someone at the a checkout stand scan it to confirm the price to make sure it was. I thought it was like going to be like 7 or $8. But no, it's four dollars. So it's you're buying the Darkness of Blaze pack, and you get a bonus extra booster with it. So you get a pretty good deal. And if you were to spend what I think four dollars, it's uh, seventy-two dollars. You're gonna get thirty-six packs. You can't buy a booster box unless you're like a store trying to sell them back for. $72. So, I mean, it'll be half Darkness Blaze, half Sword and Shield, or Rebel Clash. Magnemite. So, uh, it's, it's pretty good. I'm planning on, uh, possibly doing a, a larger video of those. Uh, maybe doing 36 packs of it, so it'll be 72 boosters, so it's a bigger one. Um, especially look out for others putting them on sale, especially if GameStop has them in stock too. Just saying, um, other places price match GameStop, so you'll be able to, um, they're mostly 20 or 25% off, and we got a Rilla Boom Hollow. I'm, I'm talking to everyone and just flipping through cards, but we've got our first hollow of the video. Um, so if you can get 20% off, or 25% off, we're going to put it down to like 3 bucks. So you can get a scorcher of a deal for some booster packs. I've seen them, people reselling those online for a lot more. I don't think they're going to run out. I don't know if it's a one-time print. So highly encourage if you got, if you're able to, um, go ahead and um, go and pick some up for yourself, or at least pick some up at that nice value. You know, and since it's scorched. So, I think it's a, a 
good thing. I think it's one of the better products coming out, along with uh, the new uh, True Seal. Like, I know, I, I think I kind of just is, like fell into that lull of things, and um, like these are the True Steel boxes. I'm, I'm patching right here, if you can see my hand, uh, but the box is right there. Uh, I, I totally slept on them. I think I saw that they were coming out, and then um, totally forgot until someone's like, True Steel, and I'm like, oh... And I went out to local store as fast as possible. I found uh, one of each to do. So I'm gonna knock them things over around here. Let's turn this in. Over the microphone's been fun. It's been turned away a little bit, but I don't think it's gonna matter on on that. I'm kind of all over the place. Um, another thing I like to thank everyone for watching. Uh, Sunday's video, the not a non Pokemon uh, related video uh, for the channel. This is a kind of like a mix up day. So, how many packs of Rebel Clash? Okay, five packs. I wasn't sure how many packs of Rebel Clash it was going to be. Um, but I really appreciate it. I know different, I know some people are just into the Pokemon and that's what they like. and if that's what you're here for the videos for, just the Pokemon ones, that's totally fine. But just wanted to say thank you for who watched. Uh, this week will be another one. Uh, don't know exactly. At Arena. So we got another Hollow Rare. Um, sure, it, it'll probably be something different than uh, Yu Gi Oh! But want to do another one and see how well that one goes. Like I said, it, it could be a temp thing, it could not be uh, energy. So, we're just going to keep going at it. Coughing, impotent, coughing. What? <laughs> Same rare. What? Uh, oh, man. So, code card so at least we're getting hollows hollows are good pit of little type volt torb sandy gas volt picks <laughs> nine tails it was a few probably a month ago something about <laughs> always pulling a nine tails like like I bought a bunch of, I had a bunch of evolutions, Rebel Clash. I think it, something else had a Nine Tails in it too, and it was just like pulling um, Hollow Rares, Reverse Hollows, and everything. It was just, I think I had about like eight or nine pulled within a couple videos. Shuffle, Scyther, Nose Pass, Wingle, Coughing, Bronzor, Trubbish, and. Elder Gospy. There we go. So, hitting another Ultra Rare out of these packs. So, a lot of these were just bought. I found them online on one of those uh, third, I guess it would be third party sailor things. L legit stuff. Um, someone just had a bunch and they were priced right. I think these came from either single blister pack or check lane blisters, but I usually just remove them out. For time's sake, for videos or for storage, it's easier to just pull and store the individual packs than it is to try to store, you know, all the blisters and stuff all together. So, Ronzor, Toxel, Athlon, Sandy Gas, and Seismitoad. So, alright, so we're getting into our two pack and then we're gonna get into our box. Like I said, this is probably one of the better deals. I don't know if there's a limitation to how much that they're doing on these. I hope they keep doing it. I, I feel like these came about due to maybe overprinting again. Like, they overprinted Sword and Shield possibly because they're expecting it to be more and it kind of died off. So they had more available like the Pokemon company this is a Pokemon company product 
Um, so, or distributors had a whole bunch left over, so they pulled them back to bull picks in the sense of sports. And they, what they'll do is they'll repackage them into new products. So there could have been an overabundance of Sword and Shield, so this is a way to get it out there. It gets a great deal for the players, especially with what's happening in the world still, the pandemic still going on. I know it's starting to get better in some places. In other places compared to here in the, you know, the States, so, but some places in the States are getting better, but it's just uh, tough, so, but I don't know if this is a way for the Pokemon company to get back. If it is, it's a wonderful thing they did, and a Mr. Ryan, so, I'm going to move some bulk, let's get the big box in here. Edges. I know it's trying to like slide your finger through without cutting yourself. I've seen other people like, it's like, how do you cut yourself on cardboard? This stuff is, is tough. Hi. <laughs> As I lift it up, geez, the scratching on this plastic. Let's, let's get this off. Card is out. Cool. It has a great assortment of, of packs. I'm seeing, I don't know if it's just regional in different parts of the world, but I've seen some come with, uh, instead of the team up pack, they come up with a uh, cosmic eclipse. So it all depends. Here's the code card for that. Then we got our figure. Might be adding some stuff to the back because we're on the sword and shield era. And then we have the Zamazenta pin right there, so we'll put those kind of in the back. I know they're going to be in there. Let's start with probably, uh, so it's so difficult to decide what to go with. I think we're just going to have to run the Charizard uh, packs. And we'll put Zamazenta. We didn't even check. So there's the promo card. You right up next to real of them. We'll go with Sword and Shield. So hopefully pull that. A Charizard. Even Team Up's got a Charizard in it. Might not be a hollow, but you can get a reverse hollow out of it. So. Because the pre-release was a hollow, and then they did the theme deck from Team Up with the Shatterfoil hollow. So they didn't put a hollow Charizard into the set. It's just a non-hollow. Mudsdale and... <laughs> <laughs> and Diddy V4. There we go. Getting the hits out of the box. Put those down. Try to slide that over. I know, I, I kind of display and they're blocked, but I'm trying to do the best. Alright, team up. Reverse Hollow Charizard. If only. Kabuto, Fairy Charm, Zora, Weedle, Joltik, Blitzel, Paris, Bisharp, and Marowat. So, no Charizard. But we have more chances. We got the code card right there. Only three, Evolutions three. Misty's Determination, Revive, Nidorino, Pikachu, Ponyta, Nidoran, Volpix, <laughs> Darkness Energy, Chansey Reverse Hollow Rare, and an Electrode. Darn. It's cool to get a Reverse Hollow Rare. So. Maybe it will save our luck for some of these other uh, back to four. So Simsage, Tormenting Spray, Bullpix, Ralts, Grimer, Sneasel, Charmander, Rhydon, and Crabomable. Darn. <laughs> Alright. 
right, here we go. The last two packs. Darkness of Blaze. Can we pull it? Can we pull the Charizard V Max? I think it would be if we did. I mean, hopefully we're going to with some booster boxes and stuff too. Be the most expensive card to pulled on the channel so far. But because I think they're going for over a hundred dollars. But a big like let it let it be. There's going to be more that flood the market. Fletching bulk Corona. Sorry. Um, there's going to be more coming to the market, so best just to sit and wait. If you're looking to pick some up. Especially if you're uh, looking to collect even graded ones. The graded ones are going to come out because people are going to rush them in to get them out to try to sell them for as high as they can. But the price is going to come down. It's going to just be like Hidden Fates Charizard or the Rainbow Rare Charizard. Someone's going to sell one really high because someone really wanted that 10. And then it's going to come back down. So, Arvesta, Vitas, Golet, Ducklet, and Pinkerton Hollow Rare. So, ending on a hollow, not going to complain. Got some good pulls from all of these, so. So, highly recommend, you know, go pick yourself up one of these boxes. Say it's six packs, if that's all you're getting with it. But, like always, I thank everyone uh, for watching the videos, liking, hitting the, the comments, so. Until next time, have a great day. See you later.